Hi, I'm Caleb. In this short video, I'll describe the different steps you'll need to take to bond aluminium. Step one, choose the right adhesive. Ensure the adhesive choice meets the requirements of the bond, such as strength, flexibility, and damage to the aluminium. Thin aluminium sheets are prone to witnessing with adhesives that have an exothermic reaction. That's the shrink on cure. Also, make sure the adhesive bonds to both substrates, as some substrates like polypropylene will need a specialist adhesive or surface preparation. Step two, prepare the surface correctly. When bonding aluminium, you must always clean the surface prior to bonding. If aluminium has heavy contamination, use IPA to degrease the surface, then activate or abrade or prime the surface depending on what your adhesive choice requires. Also ensure there are no burrs as these can lead to corrosion on the painted aluminium. Step three, apply the adhesive correctly. At this point, ensure you have the correct bond line thickness and you follow the application instructions. Step four, always allow the adhesive to cure. The cure speed will depend on the adhesive you are using, but ensure you have allowed the adhesive to reach handling strength or fixture time before you put the bonded structure into light use. If you need to process the structure faster, you can use clamps or mechanical fixings. Step five, test the bond. Once you've taken all these steps and you've allowed the adhesive to fully cure, it's highly recommended to test the bond just to be sure that it will perform as required. Thanks for watching. Don't hesitate to get in touch with an adhesive expert if you need more information.